Good morning, guys. It's Mac here from Cryptstar, and I had a few of you guys asking me how you can go ahead and claim your A0 rewards. So today, I just want to make a quick video, show you guys how to claim your rewards, or show you guys how to go ahead and automatically bond your rewards, so you can keep staking to make more and more rewards over time. As usual, if you like this channel, please make sure to subscribe down below, as well as hit that notifications bell so you can get all the latest updates and make sure you stay as lucrative as possible. Let's go ahead and head over to my desktop and I'll just go ahead and show you guys how to do this real quick. So you head over to the LF0 polkadot.js uh, substrate section and I showed you guys how to do that. You go to the LF0 uh, network and then hit switch. Now you can see here, it's been about four days since I made the last tutorial. So you can see, actually I've made a uh, 15.99 uh, as zero just by sitting and letting it stake. So how you can see this is you can go ahead and click on this little down arrow that over here on the right. So go to my accounts and then come down here and it'll show you how much you have transferable. Now, when you first stake your A0, you automatically sort of transfer the A0 when, it, when the rewards get automatically transferred to your main account. Now, you can actually change this so you can automatically stake your, your earned A0 and actually earn rewards on the earned A0 if you just want to be a long-term hodler and not have to worry about switching over and over again and having to just transfer this over to your bonded account. So in order to do that, what you can do is you can head over to staking, and then from there, head over to account, this little account tab here, press that button, and then you can click on this active nomination. So you can see here, this is my original nominated amount minus the 15 that I've earned so far. So you can press on these little three dots on the right here, and you can press change uh, rewards destination now when you press that you can actually go ahead and change it to go ahead and dash account increase the amount to stake so when you click that it'll automatically set your rewards to this stash which is right here the stash is what is actually delegated to the validator node so this will actually set it so that you can so that you can automatically earn rewards on your staked uh, on your rewards basically so go ahead and sign and submit that now just one thing to note I do say it's my ledger here but I actually just use the mnemonic key and this is not actually connected to my ledger right now so right now there's no way to go ahead and use these live networks with a ledger you have to actually just import the mnemonic key or the polka dot dot js wallet backup code and so I don't know how exactly to use this with Ledger directly. In the future, hopefully they add that functionality. Anyways, that's pretty much all you can do from here. Next, if you want to go ahead and unbond, you just press unbond and you just unbond everything and it's fine. It's very easy. But it takes about 14 days. So just realize that it's going to take you 14 days and I don't believe you receive rewards during those 14 days. So I would just keep it staked during the bear market and just pull it out once we hit the next bull if you decide to cash out or if you want to hold, do a, be a long-term hodler like me, go ahead and just keep holding on and never sell. That's pretty much it for today's video. Thank you guys for watching. I hope that helped. Peace out, everybody. Bro, we need to pop it. Everybody, go to Twitter and the hashtag the things, pump it. You know, pump it real good. We need a good pump. Everybody deserves a nice Tezos pump.